I think a dream comes true for an African team. It's the first time that an African team is part of a Grand Tour three-week stage race. The Tour of Switzerland is a sterner test than anything else the team's done. And for us, it's really a test run for, for the Tour of Spain. A lot of equipment needs to be moved around, it's a lot of travelling, it's a lot of logistics, it's a lot of everything, so I think it's just a mini preparation for the vault of us. Because we see where, where we have to do this fine-tuning to uh, become a really big team, and we have with the welder uh, three weeks where all these parts have to be together. People just loved the bike a bit more and understood it and realized the value of a bike and how it gives you independence and makes you mobile and it makes you free. And I think uh, we show the world of cycling that uh, the capability and the talent that we have. All of our riders on our team, we can see that fire in their eyes that, that they want to perform and they want to win. I think a few years back you wouldn't even have dreamt of riding Tour de Suisse and now we have four South Africans in one team in the race. And that's exactly what this team is doing, you know, taking African riders and taking the South African and African talent from this fantastic continent of ours and, uh, and showing the rest of the world potential. Good job, Jaco, good job. Our focus is to develop African young riders. And with Luis Mainkes, with Mehavi Kudus, they show that they are able to do something in the future. We have to work with them and we have to work hard to make it happen. Good, good, Luis, good. Try, try, it's good. Just try, no panic. Stay your speed and go. It's perfect, go. Everyone is dead behind, I promise you, go. They believe that they can do it. They believe that the, the victory for each and every one of them is around the corner. We'll reap the rewards of this effort in the coming years. <laughs>